I'm here at the Centenary Gold Dome, and before we go inside, Game 4 of the NBA Finals takes place tonight. Chris Middleton and the Bucks taking on Devin Booker and the Suns. Of course, Book and the Suns up 2-1 right now. Chris Middleton and the Bucks trying to tie the series at 2. Here in this city, you got to talk about Robert Williams, the young man that played for the Celtics. He shined in playoff action and put up incredible numbers. Soon and very soon will he be receiving that big check. Of course, it's not all about the money for Big Rob. He just wants to give back to his community. On July the 27th, he'll be hosting a camp right here at Centenary. We caught up with the head coach of the ladies to talk about how special this is for the community. You know, Cattle Parish Parks and Rec, Patrick Wesley and uh, Mary Murphy, they reached out to us because uh, Robert, Robert Williams wanted to run a camp uh, basically at as low of cost or free for as many kids as possible. Uh, you know, we got generous sponsors through the Cattle Parish, um, commissioners, Cattle Parish Parks and Rec, uh, to uh, Matt Wimberly at the Wimberly Agency and Sergio Flores at Mercer Tech and Home Federal Bank, all just generous, generous sponsors that allowed this to happen. Um, so we're expecting anywhere to 300 to 350 kids rolling through here in the course of two days. And you know, it's something that Robert wanted to do to give back to the community. Uh, Cattle Parish Parks and Rec wanted to, needed somebody to kind of partner with. So it's a, it's a centenary and a Cattle Parish camp with Robert Williams. Um, and we're fired up. He was here a couple weeks ago signing basketballs and um, that's going to be really cool to have him here. He's going to be at the gym as much as he can those, those couple of days. Um, and I think uh, my email has been blowing up with the registrations these last couple of days. All of a sudden we're at like 170 kids and I, I had to shoot an email to Cattle Parish. I'm like, hey, we got to cap this thing because we can't have, you know, we're going to have 10, 12 players back working it and Coach Dorsey and myself and we're fired up. It's going to be a great experience. You know, the goal is to be able to provide a camp for kids that may not necessarily have the opportunity to, to normally go to a camp. Uh, what's great is these kids have a chance to work with our players on the men's and women's side. So it's somebody that they can look to, you know, maybe some of these kids have aspirations of being a college athlete or anything like that. Uh, but beyond that, you know, just trying to teach a life lessons that it's okay to fail. Like, you know, you have plenty of kids that are like, well, coach, I didn't win this competition. It's like, well, yeah, but did you get better today over yesterday? Uh, you know, because we all got to learn how to fail. We all got to learn how to get past those failures. And I think that's, that's something that you can teach any young kid. Plus, you know, just being grateful and thankful for, to their moms and dads and grandmas, grandpas, aunts, uncles, whoever helped them get here, whether it was give them a ride here, help pay to go to camp. Uh, you know, just be thankful, grateful, and uh, move on from adversity. Shout out to Big Rob and all of the young men who are from this area. Remember, it's going to be July the 27th. Don't want to miss it. For now, in Shreveport, I'm Rashad Johnson. Back to you guys in the studio.